So the other day I wanted to record a time lapse video that lasted a few hours using my DSLR. But I ran into low battery issues. I did have an extra battery and wanted to use the two batteries together. Looking on internet I could not find an accessory that worked with my camera for such purpose. Instead. I started to look around for different battery packs. I found this NCR 18650 battery that had great energy density and was compatible with the camera. So I decided to use four of these. Next step was to design a holder for the NCR 18650 batteries. I did that in AutoCAD for both top and bottom sections of the cell. Once the model was complete. I then imported the designs into Cura and when I was happy with the print settings, I exported the G-code to print the model. Unfortunately, 3D printer needed some maintenance so I couldn't print the model. Luckily, I found 18650 brackets that did exactly what I wanted as a substitute. Next I took about the spare camera battery I had and there were no surprises there. Inside I found two LiPo cells along with the BMS circuit. This will surely come in handy later. I then took the 18650 battery cell along with its holder and put them together. Next I turned all the connection points of the battery pack and soldered a wire to them to complete the circuit. Finally I turned all the wires to increase their current capacity. Then I got a 3 pin DIN connector which will provide power out, cut a PCB to the size of the battery pack and installed the connector. I also installed a USB charging port to make the better use of the battery pack. Unfortunately the USB charging circuit got too hot and it would thermally shut down. Therefore I added another buck voltage converter to distribute the load and added other components so that I could turn off the secondary buck converter depending on the converter on the USB board. The final PCB with all the components installed looked a bit like this. I then used some hot glue to secure the battery cells and the bracket. After covering the pack in some insulation tape, I installed two polyfuses to limit the total current. And this is the circuit diagram of the whole system. The complete battery pack looks like this with all the connection ports on the side. It also works great as a USB bank. Let me know what you thought of it and thanks for watching.